Welcome to another episode of Quick Tricks for the MC101. In this video, I'm going to show you how to unlock more than four tracks for the MC101. If you're new to this channel, I make weekly videos about the MC101, so if you're interested, please subscribe to Tea Break Beats. Let's jump right in. So, obviously, the MC101 only has four tracks. In this project, I've used up all four of my tracks and want to free up some space to add additional ones. Let's take a quick listen. What I'm going to do is bounce or freeze all of these tracks into one looper track. Here's how to do it. First, make sure your project is saved. Then, save a copy of this project with a different name. I'm going to add copy at the end of the name of my project. Just to be sure that I'm not messing around with the original project, hold down project and check the current project name is the copy. Then I'm going to delete track 4 by holding shift and project together before pressing track 4 to delete it. Don't worry, I won't forget about track 4. I'm now going to create a looper track in its place. Whilst in track 4, press shift and record to change the record settings for the looper track. Scroll to rec source and choose mix out. Scroll to rec measure and choose the length of your loop. In this example, I'm going to choose 2. Whilst in track 4, go to clip and select the first clip. Press record to arm this looper clip for recording and then press play. You will now see I've bounced tracks 1 to 3 into track 4. But wait, what about the original track 4? Now's the time to bring it back in. I'll first delete tracks 1 to 3. In track 1, I'll create a looper track. In track 2, I'll create a tone track. Whilst in track 2, I'll import track 4 from my previous song. In note mode, press enter to choose a patch. Scroll to project. Find the original project and load in the track you want. I'll choose track 4. Press project and scroll to clip import. Select the original project and find the clip that you want to import. Edit the settings for your imported sound, as the MC101 won't remember the knob and send settings from the previous project. Then go back to track 1, press record to arm a clip for recording, and then press play. You have now bounced all of your original tracks to track 1. You can now delete tracks 2, 3 and 4 to free up more space. Repeat this process as many times as you like to have unlimited tracks. I hope you found this useful. Remember to check out my other videos for more quick tricks. If you like this video, hit the like button and subscribe to Tea Break Beats for more videos like this one.